Hey, welcome back to the channel, Getting It Done Fishing. All right, you know, today we're going to talk about, you know, why we spend so much money on fishing lures. So, you know, we spend a ton of money on fishing lures. These fishing lures are getting really, really expensive. I mean, like super, super expensive. Two companies, I'll tell you a little story, and uh, two companies reached out to me to promote their products. Uh, I'm not going to mention their names. I'm not going to talk about the, uh, the lure company that they were or the product company that they were. But one of them says, hey, you know, you know, getting it done fishing, loved your videos, loved your YouTube channel, and we would love for, for you to test our product out. You know, we need a couple videos. We need you to test it out there, catch some fish with the product, use the product, explain the product, and go through the product. And I'm like, you know what, it might be pretty interesting. And, you know, so I, I read through the contract and, and all that good stuff. And, you know, there was a little bit of money here and there and kind of going back and forth. But I looked at their products, <coughs> excuse me, and I went on their webpage. And they were going to send me a bunch of stuff for free, a bunch of lures for free. And again, I had to do the videos. I had to, they wanted me to go out there and catch some bass. You know how to get it done. You know how to get it done with the lures, you know. You know no matter what lures, you know how to get it done because it's getting it done fishing. But I started looking at the lures. And there's some pretty cool lures. Again, I don't, I don't want to drop the uh, company's name or anything like that. But I started looking at it, and I'm like, holy cow. They're like $17.99 per lure. And I'm like, oh, hold on. Stop. You want me to promote? And you want me to go to my audience, you guys, my subscribers, the people that watch my channel, and you want me to tell my, to, to my followers to buy these products. And I started going through it, and I'm like, you got to be kidding me. And they offered like a 30% discount. I'm like, even at $17, $18 a pop, I'm like, you're getting it down for $14. Now, there's no way we should be spending over $10 a lure. No way in heck, as fishermen, no matter what you're fishing for, we shouldn't be spending more than $10. I think that is absolutely insane. I went through the whole products, I went through all their lures. Again, some of the lures are pretty cool. Uh, some of the lures I probably would use, don't get me wrong, I probably would uh, use. And some of them are actually pretty excited, like, man, I wonder if, you know, I'm starting to, I was starting to think, the ponds that I fish and the lakes I fish, and I was like, man, I bet you I could catch some, I bet you I could catch some big ones with some of these. But again, I, I couldn't wrap my head around coming on here and asking you guys to buy these lures that were, you know, even with a 30% discount, uh, you know, you guys spending $12, $15 per lure. Hey, listen, we all lose, we all lose lures. Sometimes they snap off. Uh, sometimes you catch in a big ones and it snaps. Um, you know, that's a lot of money. That's a lot, a lot of money, especially if you're talking different colors, different types of, different times of the year, you use different colors. And I'm just not comfortable with that. I, I'll be honest with you. I'm just not comfortable with that. I'm not comfortable asking you guys, uh, you know, hey, there's a code below. Hit that code. And, uh, you know, you save yourself $30 on, on this company. No matter how successful that lure is, I, 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 I can't, me personally, uh, I, I can't do that to you guys. I, I don't want to do that to you. So I said, you know what? Let's just talk about why we spend so much money on lures. And there's really, I'll be honest with you, I fish a lot of different lures. I fished a lot of different lures over, I'm just gonna say over the last three years. I mean, I fished a lot of different lures. I, I like to test out different lures. Uh, you know, again, especially if I watch like Bassmasters or MLF or any other thing, and, or watch a guy on uh, Jacob Wheeler and, and Crush City. And I'm like, oh man, I gotta go check some of those out. Those look pretty cool. Then you start looking at the price, I'm like, oh man, that, that's a tough pill to swallow. So I wanted to just kind of talk about it and say, you know what, why are we doing this? There's no need for it. The other company that sent the, uh, that, that asked me to promote their product, it was the same thing. I think their lures were like $12. Again, what they want me to do, they want me to come out here, they want me to introduce the lure, want me to introduce the brand, and they're willing to give anybody, you know, a code, you know, drop the code below, go on to there and you use a discount code and it saves you some money. Again, I don't feel comfortable with that. Um, and I don't really feel comfortable asking you guys to spend over $10 or lure. Uh, so I couldn't do it. I'm not doing it. And, you know, I, I just don't, it doesn't feel right. There's only one lure in this world, in this world today, that I would ever spend more than $10 on. There's only one. And, and I'm going to explain to you why. And that is the Z-Man uh, Jackhammer Chatterbait. That's the only one. And there's only one in particular that I would buy. It's a different color blade. It's like a grayish blade. Uh, if you haven't watched my videos, and I'm about to pop off a couple of videos that, that, that I've used, I call some big ones on, especially in the fall. I like it some big ones, bro, some big ones, getting it done, yes sir. And I, I can't find that anywhere else. I can't find that combination. It's baby gill, uh, baby bluegill, 
Uh, it is a uh, Z-Man jackhammer chatterbait. I love the color, uh, especially in the fall time. Uh, just as the, it's the only blade I've ever seen in that color or, or, or a different manufacturer that makes that blade. It's like a grayish, like a dark gray blade to it. And then it has like the, the baby bluegill and it's, and it's white. Uh, definitely, absolutely money. But that's the only lure and it's very specific to a color or very specific to, to what I, when I would use it. And that's in the fall time. I only have one. I only bought one. Um, that one and then there's a gold one that, that I would buy. That's the only two that I would ever buy. You know, because you could go and you could go on, on Timu and you could get chatterbaits. And I've been saying it for years that chatterbaits from Z-Man, I mean from Z-Man, from Timu are just as good as any other chatterbait on the market. The difference, I, or the only thing I don't like about Timu chatterbaits is that sometimes you're stuck and they're very limited on their color selection. Again, you're not gonna go on a Timu and there's not gonna be like a, like the Z-Man, you're gonna have 20 options. You're gonna have like three, four, five options. Now again, when you go on a Timu and you buy a chatterbait, now I'm telling you, you have to be careful. I only go 15 grams and 11 grams. That's the only two I buy and I'm very, particular on my blade size so on 11 11 grams i want that bigger blade and i'll drop a i'll drop the link below and then these things and again i'm only spending you know two dollars two dollars and fifty cents now i'm buying a z-man jackhammer and i'm spending you know fifteen dollars and i'm gonna buy those bluegill ones because i love that again it's just a different color blade it's just i don't know it's just magic in the fall time and that's thirty dollars say i buy two of them which i probably buy more I probably buy three or four to make sure that if I ever lose it, I have it. So if I buy four, that's $60. I could probably buy like 20 of these and it'll last me probably for three years, four years, maybe five years. Um, but again, it's only very specific to a color and it's specific to the time of the year that I fish it. Um, but going back to, I, I, I went back, I started searching all these different websites and, and I'm looking at the prices of these lures. It's just astronom astronomically ridiculous. And that's why I switched over to Timu. Uh, pretty much 80% of the of the lures I buy, the hard lures, the hard lures I buy, the lures, lures I buy are from uh, Timu. You know, the soft plastics, you know, it's a hit and miss. And you can spend a lot of money on the soft plastics finding that right one. And sometimes you could find it, you know, sometimes you could, you could find the right, what you're looking for. Um, but it's really a hit and miss on, on Timu on the soft plastics. You really have to know the size you're looking for, the di diameter, diameter that you're looking for, and, and you have to be careful. You know, I came out in the beginning of this year, I was talking about these bad boys. I got a whole big package of these things. And, and these, things are, these things are pretty good. I've seen other people on, uh, on YouTube use these. You know, these, these things. You know, again, I've used them on uh, chatterbaits. I use them on some uh, swim jigs. Uh, so they're pretty, actually pretty good. But I stay away from soft plastics when it comes to Timu. Um, so, but now all the hard lures that I use all come from Timu. I can't, I can't spend $12, I can't spend $15. And I'm surely not gonna ask you guys to spend $15 on a lure. So, you know, for me, we, we just have to stop the madness. And hopefully, you know, if, if we could kind of drive it to another place, hopefully some of these other brands and these new companies will start to bring down the price. Again, if, I, if you're spending $10, $15 on a lure and you buy maybe 20 lures, well, you're talking 200 bucks, 300 bucks just in lures. And that doesn't include the ones you lose. Same thing with the Whopper Plopper. I mean, I, I love Whopper Plopper. If you watch my channel, you, you know I'm a big, huge Whopper Plopper guy. Like, I'll throw Whopper Ploppers all day long. But again, you're looking at $15, Timu, $1.99. Boom. Yes, sir. Getting it done. And they're, I've used them. I've caught big bass on them. They're great hooks. In great quality, I'm spending two, three dollars. I don't even think three dollars. I think it's like two fifty. I think the colors are better. They work just as good, if not better, than a whopper plopper. So why spend the money? So I don't think you'll ever see me on this channel. Mark my words. I don't think you ever see me on this channel promoting products that I'm asking or I'm even gonna buy that are over ten dollars. Besides the jackhammer, the Z-Man jackhammer, uh, and that's again because of the color, because of the blade color, and that's the only reason. But we have to stop buying these types of lures. I mean, it's, it's ridiculous. And I had two companies come to me, two, two companies want me to you know, promote their product, and I said, hey, I, I just can't do it. I'm sorry, I can't do it. Not for that price point, I, I can't. I'm a big Timu man, 
you know, obviously Timu doesn't uh, sponsor me or anything like that. I don't get anything free from Timu. But, you know, I'm just here to help and say, you know, you can get a, a, a chatterbait from Timu that's just as good. And if you lose it, you don't feel bad. I mean, I've got it stuck on logs. I broke them off of logs. I've had bass break them off. I had them snap when I cast. Hey, no big deal. It's $2, right? And you could buy it. You could buy them uh, early in the year, you know, <laughs> in the wintertime. Stock up on them. Get ready for the season, and you never have to worry about it. Now these, kind of really quick, these these come in like in a, I think it was four different colors or five different colors. And I think they were, you could buy like a five pack. And I think the five pack was like $8.99. And, and again, I use these all the time, especially in the springtime. I, I, I love these. Again, my only issue is I certain times of the year or certain situations, I just look for it. Just a, uh, I just, I'm, I'm, I'm a little finicky on, and the blade and and the, and the color but these things will catch you bass there's all different types of kinds in there I've, i did a product review on one that had the that had the swivel was up and through up and through the head of it uh, i caught bass on them um, money you know they all start as soon as you as soon as you reel all that blade will start vibrating and it all works out so you know let's stop Let, let's just get real let's save some uh, let's save some money together and uh, let's stop buying these expensive lures you know and again um, I, if you have a lure from Timu, you say, hey, I'm on a fence, drop the comment below, I'll buy them, I'll test them out, I'll, I'll give you a realistic uh, opinion of it, I'll tell you the truth about it, I'll tell you if it works or doesn't work, and, and we go from there. All right, I hope you guys liked the video. Hey, don't, don't forget to do all the great things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, notifications, all that good stuff. I greatly appreciate it, and I'll catch you next time I get into done fishing.